Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be taking a look at a couple new frames. They're little micro 2.5 inch frames from Aeronaut FPV. Now these were provided me by Aeronaut FPV and um, I wanted to give them a shout out as well as take a look at these. So all of them here are 2.5 inch micro quadcopters. They only take 11xx motors as I could tell by the whole size here. And let's just take a look from this one up to the hex copter right there, which is this is this is just absolutely phenomenal. So this one here is um just basically just you know you're gonna have your just top stack here. It's kind of meant for racing. Um, there is nothing really special about this. I mean the way that I got it is um just like this. I I, I don't know uh, if they even have this one on the website or it's a prototype, but it looks pretty cool and pretty interesting. I mean it's um. It's going to be very light, actually. I, I, I don't know what I would use this for, to be honest. Um, you're going to need to put like a large stack up top, but there is no uh, way for me to mount this. They didn't give me any 3D printed part to mount this, so I have no idea what to do with this one. But yeah, maybe he forgot it. He'll let us know. I don't, I don't think I saw it on the website. I'll leave the website down below. So let's just uh, move this to the side right now, and uh, maybe we'll do something with this later on. I don't know. So here we have both frames. Now these are, um, I don't know, I didn't see this one on the website just yet. Now both of these are 2.5 inch prop, uh, up to 2.5 inch prop capable. And it looks like 11XX motors, so like an Emacs 1106, something 1103, something 1105, whatever brand. You'll be totally fine, up to a 2.5 inch prop, which is like kind of like the gem fans, uh, which would run very well on these. Now the structure here, the carbon's actually pretty tough for, for, uh, for being for just... This is very nice to see. I really like it. I didn't expect it this uh, tough here. Uh, it does have some flicks here and there, but nothing too major. It's a, I believe this is three three millimeters thick, and uh, the upper plate here is a three D printed TPU. As you can tell, it's very flexible, and it's held. You know, it's adding some extra structural integrity with some nylon standoffs in the middle. You would just add here. Now he does provide you with everything here, and uh, in the front here, you see it like this because the camera would go in there and it would add the extra structural integrity here. But overall, these are pretty nice. I really want to try to build this one. I have some RCN Power 1108 motors, uh, which I think would just be phenomenal on this one. I got six of them from RCN Power, so that's very nice of them. So this one here is 24 grams, which is pretty crazy. This is the Hexcopter 2.5 inch, so that's pretty awesome. And this one is 17 grams, I think. Let me just double check this. Yeah, 17 grams. So this one's 17 grams and the Hexcopter, I think was what? 24 grams, yeah, 24 grams. So they're pretty sick actually, they're pretty nice. I really like to see some type of little innovation. I mean, there's only so much you can do and um, yeah, this is just pretty cool from uh, Aaron. Uh, so if you wanted to go ahead and check them out, the, they're based in the UK, so they ship to obviously Europe with no customs and stuff. So it's very cool for Europe. And I believe they do have fast shipping for the USA. I'm not really sure, but I'm, I'm pretty sure they do. But um, yeah, because UK has the best uh, postal services out there, so they have some pretty sick uh, options for sending stuff, which is very nice. So overall, that's really it, guys. That's going to conclude it for this video, guys. I just wanted to make a little shout out and just check out a couple of their frames. I don't know when I'll be building them. I'm not going to make any promises because I still have a lot of things to finish right now. And um, overall, this is, you know, they're very innovative and they try to do some crazy cool stuff. They do some feather-like quads. We've built one which was like insanely light. It's just crazy. So I'll leave a link down to link, leave a link to the website down below and go ahead and check them out. And um, yeah, that's it, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, please consider joining my Patreon. It really helped this channel keep going. And um, things have been get, kind of getting a little... Um, yeah, but yeah, so please consider joining my Patreon. You get awesome things. I do a lot of giveaways and uh, awesome little secret shop access and stuff where I sell my stuff for completely cheap and you get discounts and crazy stuff. So that's going to conclude it for this video, guys. And I'm going to let you go and I will see you next time. See you guys. Take care.